Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Amnesia The Dark Descent. So, last time we started off uh, this very lovely game. Um, and we, so what we learned last time is that our name, our character's name is Daniel. He comes from Mayfair, well he lives in, in uh, at Mayfair in London. And he's in this place, which I think is like a, oh, sorry, did not mean to do that. I don't know why the screen is like blue right now, uh, but that doesn't matter. That's okay. Um, and we're in this place. I'm not sure what it is just yet. I think it's like um, the the Baron's castle or something. And uh, basically what, what we were told to do is find Alexander of Brennenberg, I think, and kill him. Apparently he's, uh, he's, he's the ultimate goal, so I suppose we'll have to try and find him at some point. So, we stopped here, and I'll, I will just keep going for now. Though I am very reluctant to. Oh god. I. Ugh. I'll pick up that oil. Thank you very much. We also have a lantern on us, which is very nice. Oh god, what's happening? And apparently, uh, on top of... On top of, uh, this entire situation... Some, some darkness is chasing us. Uh, so that's, that's nice. Okay. Cat, get off. Uh, okay. Right. Diary. What the hell is happening? May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Yeah, this it is was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and in possible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety, and grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Well that was, uh, that was something else. That was something else. Chemistry part, okay. Okay, interesting. So, I'm guessing that relic and that expedition to whatever desert that was, that is, that, he, that, that was that he was in, uh, has something to do with his story. Well, we, well what I mean is like, it's got to do something. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. 
We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Okay. God, that's bright. Aha, a chest. Um, hello? I don't like all these noises, dude. I ah, oh, I don't like them at all. Oh, must find a new way out of this area. Okay, yeah, gotcha. Uh, okay, okay. E okay. Well, I can see this here. Did I do that? I don't know if I did that. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. Alright. There's some sort of secret door mechanism in the local history room. This is where we are now. Oh. The draft on a faint line are coming from behind the shelf. There must be a way in. I'm just going to use Tinder to light this up. I thought that would work. Okay. Altsuk and Brunberg Castle, 1801. Another region which uh, rich with the law is Altstadt, deep within the East Prussian woods. For centuries there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbour, Castle Brunberg. The quiet forest clad mountain dressed with scattered lakes is as picturesque as can be, albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any local and you will hear, you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travellers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists on the tales, but there are some motifs that keep reappearing. The Gatherers The story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold dark woods and were forever damned to roam the grounds. Their bodies, wrought by their tainted souls, have left them dis disfigured and empty of essence. Many have sighted them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks dragged behind them which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? A visit undone. Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa, the well-known er erudite visited Alstad at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdoms past. During his stay, all the prominent members of society paid notice and he is mentioned in many records of the time. One day, he went to investigate a borough in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grenoble some 10 years later. That's in France, Grenoble. He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Alstad, which makes you wonder what really happened. 
He was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods and what happened to him? Oh, this is the last one. The Immortal Baron. Oh, it didn't... Oh, never mind. The Baron of Brandenburg lives a reclusive life with his family at his castle nearby Alstad, and, it, and like most of those most of those of noble birth, rumours are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander, a nearborn from the Rhinelands, claim, uh, claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Alexander helped the region to flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. Family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage. Therefore, the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that Varen is in fact the one and the same who came from, from the West over 300 years ago, lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle along with the great leaders of this country. Okay. Interesting. So we've got a few books here. Books that I think serve as, as keys. Aha, gotcha. Also, what's in here? It's locked, okay. So I don't know if this is the kind of game to have like a monster in it. Um, because they, they've mentioned like... They've mentioned like a darkness uh, chasing us. Oh, hello. Regarding closing of the wine cellar. Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brandenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. What it comes first, they can rot for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would, in a sense, solve both of my problems. Indeed. Ah! I do not like... I do not like the sound of that. Okay. Oh, are these some of the visions that we experience in? So there's nothing there? Oh man, I don't... All is good. Hey, what's this? Oh, chemistry part, okay. I don't know if there's something else with me here. Oh, this is freaking me out so much. I keep hearing stuff. Oh. I don't... okay. Ho 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 ho, I don't like this one bit. I do not like this one bit. Is it wise to go in there? Oh, I, I regret this a lot.
No, 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 no. Yo, what the fuck is playing the piano? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Go back to where you belong, book. Uh, let's maybe put a bit of oil in the lamp. Man, I don't... Oh, I don't like this. Oh, oh God. Um... Okay, oh! I think I know what to do. Okay, so the light does restore our, our vision back to its normal state. Man, this, this game really knows how, knows how to put you on edge. Like, it nails every little sound just to, to sort of really make you doubt what's around the corner. Oh god, I, I... Huh? Oh my god, I don't like this at all. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. Whew. Statues were praying, gazing into the dark dome ceiling. Oh man, I really hate this. Oh, what's this about? Oh. All is good, not all is good, you twerp. Oh my god, okay. Uh, just gonna refill the lamp a bit. Oh god, okay. Okay, so we, we have to go to the wine cellar now. <gasps> Tinderbox. Sneaky, sneaky. It's okay, I can I can handle this. I can handle this. No big deal. I'm sorry if I'm going... I, I'm sorry if I'm going, like, painfully slowly. I just... Uh, I mean, that's the point. That's the point, right? You have to be careful. Like... You... you it wouldn't make sense to have to rush. That's the lab. So down to the one side. No, 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 no. Back to normal vision. Back to normal. Okay, to the one side we go. The desert dunes were like waves in a sluggish sea. While the caravan moved, the land appeared motionless, but in camp, the hills moved. Oh man, I already hate this. Beware, when standing in darkness, your sanity will slowly drain. Turn on lights in the army using tin boxes, or search for other sources of light. Okay, there, yeah, that I know. We were, I think they, they explained that. My headache. So if, if, we, if we stand in the light, we'll be fine. Oh dear God, please no. Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left us enough wine the last 
with us a lifetime. Or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> so these are the guys he locked up um, in, in the cellar. I'm not too sure why he locked them up. So this this won't budge. If there's an enemy nearby. What enemy? Oh my god. What enemy? Oh my god, I hate this. I hate this so much. I, I really don't like this. And we haven't even gotten to like any any particularly scary part. This game nails atmosphere, Jesus. Barrels! My worst enemy. Barrels. I don't know what enemy is chasing us though, or wh what's... Oh god, okay, so our sanity just went really, really low. Okay, so we just picked up... Um we just picked up a jar of opamin. Okay. The appropriate apparatus. Okay, gotcha. So we, we should probably try and find all, all the ingredients, right? Okay, okay. Let's just restore some of my sanity, please. Um, I can just stand in the light, right? So, okay, okay. Oh, we should be fine. Oh. No, it's okay, nothing's happening. Nothing is happening. Barrels. Ugh, that is disgusting. I don't like the dot dot dot. It, it, I really don't. Yeah, I have no idea what enemy is near though. Okay, here we go. Stand in the light a bit. What's 
happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Oh, it sounds like a bit. Ugh, that doesn't sound like a very nice death. Not that any, well, well, some deaths are nice. I will grab this tinder box gladly. So I don't know if we make, like, if we make noise, do we attract? Oh, the trailer liquid. Aquaragia. Wilhelm's last word. My name is Wilhelm House of Gedek. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle in Brandenburg. As most of the aristocracy, I was curious about what the supposed knight of the order could want from me and accepted the invitation. Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past, not the honors I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position with, with a noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted it wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I've brought men, women, and children to Brandenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in the toast. The wine tasted fine, and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolic ways. My men are screaming their skin had been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer see. Okay. Okay. Interesting. So he just he just he was basically tying up loose ends. He was just basically tying up loose ends. No witnesses whatsoever. So um Evidence in the laboratory has revealed that combining four chemicals, four chemicals, we only have two. Four chemicals, we don't have all of them, okay. Okay. Oh, I don't like these creepy crawlies all, all over my screen, thank you very much. Okay, cool. Refilled the, uh, the lantern, which is good. Oh, God. Ah, another... Barrels! God damn it. Oh, it's giving me the shows. Let's 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 calm down, okay. Oof. I bet there's like a secret here. 
Or not, okay. Okay, I'm just trying to get these out of the way. Oh, wait, hold on. Can clear the way, that's pretty cool. Uh, can I? Okay, surely there's a way to do this. There we go. Okay, uh, actually, you know what? I think we might wrap it up here, guys. Um, we're running up to 32 minutes. Um, I feel like we've made good progress. Uh, we got the key to the wine cellar. Let's see here. And it, I think we need, like, one more... Um... Notes. Chemical relocation. We need Calamine Openment, Cuprite, and Aqua Regia, right? We need Cuprite as the last ing ingredient, I think. So I feel like I feel like we've made good progress for this, and that afterwards, I'm guessing we need to do like the, um, yeah, we need to combine the four chemicals to create a powerful acid. I don't know what we'll use that for afterwards, but we'll see. Um, but all, all in good time, all in good time. Uh, I, feel, I, really, I feel like we've made good progress. Uh, so far, no creature, uh, or whatever. I mean, I, I heard like pig noises, so I'm not sure what that was. Uh, but man, th this game is, is constantly keeping me on edge, like with all the little noises. And I don't know, it's just, uh, it does a very good job at it. So <laughs> there you go. Uh, I think it was quite a fitting choice for spooky season. So. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of uh, Amnesia the Dark Descent, and I will see you all in the next video. Oh, sorry, and remember, uh, I always leave links in the description to ongoing series. Uh, so this time I'll be leaving a link to the Amnesia series. If you haven't seen the first episode, I suggest you, you start with that if you're new to this Let's Play. And um, yeah, I will see you all in the next video.